guys, welcome back to Enigma 77 Reviews. So today, we've kind of got my Halloween backdrop, not the one I wanted. So I have said in a previous video, my little um, kind of disappointment with the backdrop thing. So I, I did order Jack Skeleton, but unfortunately I kind of got duped. So I'm waiting for my money to come back from that. I have ordered another one, it's more spooky, and it's not arrived. Ah! there's a spider <laughs> oh um two minutes guys there's a bloody spider above my head uh cut i was going to cut that out guys but i thought no all right there's a sp there was a spider and it was like crawling up like i don't know if you saw it on the camera but it crawled all the way up and uh, all the way to my fan at the top um my dad's here so my dad had to climb up on the chair and get it because i have a savage phobia of spiders Anyway, guys, what I've got on my head is a little clue of what's to come. So my TK Maxx um, and my range delivery came today. <sighs> so excited to show you, but I'm not gonna show you yet. So we're gonna have to save for that. And this hat is a part of one of the things I got. Obviously I've, I've got it as a headband as well because I think it looks absolutely groovy and fantastic and very gothic. And yes, I know there's a spider on the front of it, but um, it looks more like a crab than a spider, so I don't mind it so much. So this was from TK Maxx, guys. We'll discuss that when we do the TK Maxx haul. So for now, I'm just going to put him over here on my burner. Right, so today, guys, we've got a bit of a mixed haul. We've got a Poundland Halloween special haul. Because, guys, I take back what I said. I said that Poundland had hardly any decorations in and it sucked take all that back i went in today and omg i was like i was in heaven i mean i've got hair in my eyes i was planning to get a few things from poundland anyway like decoration wise just a few things that i wanted to grab that i didn't grab last time and i was like i spent a lot of money in there i spent 30 pound 30 pound which i was supposed to be saving for something else oops i'm just going to get it back somehow but what I've got today is amazing, so I can't wait to show you. First of all, um, there's two Scully pens. I'm going to show you these two. These are not from the pen shop. These were bought, my dad brought these to me. These were bought in a shop in um, Littleborough called Bottoms Mill. And um, they were £2.98. Woo! <laughs> the freaking spiders on the bloody thing! <laughs> I hope professional of me. Guys, I'm really sorry. The spider was on the school pen and I nearly lobbed it. So it's gone now. It's gone. <laughs> Contain myself. I tell you, I've got real bad fear of spiders. So these are pens and one's red and one's purple. I'm not too sure what colour they're right. Ow, it's quite scratchy. Um, I haven't got any paper to hand, guys, to, to kind of try it. Let me just... Oh, uh, one's blue. I think they're both blue. So the blue ink pens, the proper potty pens. How cool are them? And as you know, my spine, I wish my spine looked like that. My spine is curved, so it's like that in a C curve. So yeah, these were, I think they were £2.50. Absolute bargain. So I got them too. And then I'm going to get straight into Homeland. I did go into Hobbycraft, guys, and I picked up these. And they're little black and white skulls, and they're sprinkles, sugar decoration skulls. These were a pound, guys. You get quite a lot in the bag. I think there's about, ooh, I don't know. I ain't got my glasses on. I can't be bothered putting them on. I think there's about 100 grams, something like that. But they're a pound. As you know, me and Zach, well, you don't know, but me and Zach make Halloween cakes, and we have, like, the black icing and the orange icing i'm going to go ahead and buy the orange ones of these but for a pound i thought they were really really good so i grabbed them right let's get to pound shop so let's just start with the munchies guys because um i go into hospital next friday and i want some munchies to come home to i don't know if i'm going to feel like eating anything to be honest with you but in case i do i grabbed these because i absolutely love them so these are the spicy hula hoops if you've not tried these, they're like the corn maize. Absolutely adorable. The only problem is, guys, I cannot stop halfway. I have to eat the whole bloody bag. 
So I've got these to share. And it says tangy cheese and salt and vinegar. I tried the cheese, guys, and I didn't like them Ugh, at all. But I do like the salt and vinegar. And I did buy... <laughs> so, yeah, they're a pound each, guys. So I've got three of them because... I think for, they were that price under a bargain. And I got my husband some crisps because he likes this kind of thing. And this is wasabi. So it's got to be some kind of pepper. One that <coughs> preferably I ain't going to try. Um, and it says perfect with beer. And I, my husband drinks real ale, like a proper Viking met lead. So I got him a pack of them. He's tried the other two. One's chicken wings and one's jalapeno. So I got them. Right, let's get into the interesting things. So... I've seen these in Poundland. There is some more sweet things. Quickly, let's grab these. Yeah, they're going in, they're going to go in my hospital bag. So just to take it with me. So I've seen these and me and my dad were just like two big kids in the pound shop just playing with all the Halloween stuff. So what started off as a tiny little aisle of stuff was a whole two wide aisles of Halloween things. And Oh my God, have they got a selection in there. Go and check Poundland. <coughs> I think they were just teasing us with the little bits that they had there. And then, like, because I went in, there was hardly anything. And I've got in again and it was massive of stuff. So, I'll be ready for this. So, I'm going to go off and I'm going to come back on with number one. <laughs> so, this is the first one. Um, Zach loves teddy bears. He used to hate them, but now he loves them. I think he might hate them again after this. But this <sighs> is my creepy bear number one. So these were two pound guys and they're called furry masks. I think they're absolutely amazing. So they are fair, but then it's like plastic and they have this tea bar in the middle. So your nose can rest comfortably on there. So I'm sorry guys if my eyebrows are smudged. It's because I've been messing about with these all afternoon. Me and Zach and my dad have been running around like Looney Tunes, like scaring each other. So I got this one because I just thought I love teddy bears. And then mask number two. Ta -da! I had to get this one because this was like the scary gothy kind of teddy bear. And I just absolutely love it. I had to love it. I can see perfectly. I can smell perfectly. And again, it has the tea bar at the back with all my makeup on. Ah, I absolutely love these guys. So there was three. I'm gonna show you the third one now. There was three of them. And it, I'm not joking, guys. They've got a lot of fur on them. They've got a little bit of, they will come off eventually this fur, the more you like wear them and stuff. But I think these are absolutely fantastic. You could actually get like um, a faux fur, like, blanket because I've got a brown one so I can put it with my brown one and <laughs> just go around scaring everybody so last but not least is this one this one's the worst <laughs> <laughs> so this is Terra Bunny I love this one guys I can actually just put my hood just like gently there and like hi welcome to my channel so guys if you want to see these masks start all over Halloween, let me know which masks you want me to put on and we'll try and do a bit of a Halloween special with these masks. So, yeah. So, they were £2 each, guys. So, yeah, I know some people won't like to pay that, but there's some, like, latex masks. Well, £30 and I just think they're just as good. So, I was quite happy with them. Moving on to the next thing, I was just dead excited to show you, was this. Now, as you know, I am um, Corpse Bride and I've searched everywhere for like black headbands with black roses on and I can't find any. So I found this and although I've got a veil, this can sit over the top of my white veil and I just think it's really fetching and it just sits on. It's like a bit of the Day of the Dead. I have got one of these in black and red that I wore last year, but... Just for the, what I'm doing, I've got blue hair, obviously. And I just thought that was amazing. And it was a pound, guys. So I've never seen, like, Poundland do anything like this before. So I grabbed that, guys. And then I grabbed... Oh, two minutes, guys, because everything's going to fall out. Then I grabbed these. 
to go with my blue flowers. So we've got blue flowers that are quite living and then I'm gonna have these like the, the dead flowers. So you get my gist. So they're a pound as well, guys, and I'm kicking myself because I paid three pounds summit for them blue ones, but I needed blue anyway for the theme. I keep thinking I'm seeing a spider. Right, next, guys, I grabbed two more of these. I could not resist. So these are the glass light-up ones, and I'll show you, even though you've seen them before, you just take the pull-out tab, put it in, voila. These are absolutely amazing, guys. Now, I've got two already. Um, they're on my shelf. These are going to sit downstairs or on my desk through the Halloween season. And um, the good thing about these, guys, is when you're finished, you could use these for, like, gin or vodka. I mean, I've had a big bottle of vodka in this kind of skull head, and I turned that into a lamp. So you could kind of work it the other way around. So they're a pound each, guys, and they had absolutely loads. I could have bought 10 of them, but I was like, I don't need 10. Like, Rachel, you don't need 10. So, yeah, they were £2. So I was like, yeah, they had so much stuff in, guys. I've got so much Halloween stuff, it's unreal. So then I grabbed two of these because you know I love this colour and you'll figure it out as soon as you see them. So I've just bought a skull cup in this ir like iridescent kind of different colour, rainbow colour, and I've got all kinds of things in it. So I got two of the pumpkin ones, and these are proper, like, pot, ceramic pot. Now, these are candle. You just put your candles in there, and they light up. So I do have two orange pumpkins from last year, but I just couldn't resist these because of the colour. I'll probably keep these out all year round. I don't think I'm going to put any of my stuff away. Maybe for ever. I don't know. So they're a pound each, guys. They had different ones and I mean so many different ones they had um they had clown ones they had skeleton skull ones they had cat ones they had ghosty ones they had pumpkin ones yeah you get the gist they had quite a lot so carrying on my Halloween theme I grabbed one of these because I seen um Gina did this it sparkle and I just thought oh I've got to have one of them I might give it a wipe because it's a bit scratched and this is a light, guys. Um, I think it's got a tab in it. Let me just pull. Oh, are they tight and not put any batteries in it? Yeah, so there's no, there's no batteries in it, guys. But it don't matter because I've got loads and loads of these batteries. But that lights up and it's a little skeleton in the graveyard coming out of his um, tomb. I think that's fab. I should have grabbed two, actually. But you know what? There's got to be a, a limit to this Halloween stuff. And guys, I'm not joking. When I show you everything that I've got, and it won't be in one video... This is just the Poundland video today and a couple of bits I've got from other places. So that was that. And then I grabbed this little pumpkin that says Boo. Um, because my fireplace is going to be based around the pumpkin theme and lights and stuff like that, I couldn't resist getting this. And it is just like plastic, I think. I'm not too sure. But it was a pound. They had them in black as well. And then I grabbed... Coming to the end now, guys. I grabbed this little fella who's a little jibber-jabber dude. Obviously, when you take it out, it moves. So I quite fancied the cat and the pumpkin. Now, this is a solar-powered light, guys, solar wobbler. So I'll probably leave this on my window in the daytime for it to charge up. And then, obviously, it will just sit and wobble on my desk. These were a pound. They had about three different three different ones, three different designs. Um, they had a ghosty one as well, I think, maybe a clown one. And I was just like, I'd buy everything, guys, if I could. And then I picked up, what is that? What is this that's in here? Oh yeah, I grabbed this as well. Right, and then I grabbed, this is this. So I grabbed this, which is the purple gothy nails. Now, I wanted to go to Primark and grab the nails, but as you know, I'm going to hospital next week and I'm not allowed to put any nails on, but I've got these for like near the time of Halloween when I'm probably feeling a bit better. So there's not much point in me going all the way to Primark. I may go at weekend. I'll see. I'll see how I feel. I may go at weekend and grab a few packs. But these have them crazy looking eyelashes, which, guys, I don't think I'll wear. But I don't know. We'll see. I might wear them for the, the bride. If they had them in blue, I would have bought them and done it for the blue. But these are purple and they were a pound. So that was that, guys. Then just a couple of homeware things. I got two of these for a pound because my husband's doing some cooking of some kind. 
And then I grabbed a bag of the Haribo trick or treats. Now I probably will go back and get a few more packs of these next week before I go into hospital for the trick or treaters. Uh, and we do order someone as the delivery, so trick or treats always have enough sweets when they come here. So they were a pound as well, guys. And then I grabbed a few more products before I do that. I picked up these as well, guys. I can't remember where I picked these up. Might have been home bargains, I don't know. But they're Belgian waffles, chocolate sugar waffles. Um, yeah, my husband's a sports some ice cream. He thinks that when I come out of hospital, a bit of ice cream and waffles just as a bit of a sugary pick me up. So that was that, guys. And then I picked up, and I know I'm not supposed to, but I couldn't help it. It was a lavender pillow spray, guys. And I don't see this as being the cosmetics for me. It is for me, this, because... I'm struggling with sleep and I'm going to take this into hospital with me. So for that reason, I don't really care. I, I was buying it. And you just spray it on your pillow and it's supposed to help you sleep. I have tried this before and I absolutely loved it. Not this brand. I think it was Balance Me. But this were a pound. So I thought I was having that. And then I picked up these two for a gift. Um, one is purple, which is model zone. And one is red. Yeah, my colours, but they're not for me. I'm going to leave them in the pack. Uh, I don't know what they look like um i don't know if i can open them without i don't want to swatch them let's see if i can take one out and show you quickly guys oh okay so it is actually lipstick so they're pretty good aren't they they're pretty cool i might go back and get some more of them um i think they had other colors but i like model zones nail varnish i've never really tried their makeup but yeah that was good so that was that guys that is that is it that is it that is my Halloween from um, Permland. And that is it for Halloween from Permland. I won't be going back to Permland now to get any more Halloween stuff. I think I have got pretty much stuff. I think I've got enough stuff to keep me going. Right, guys. So, as you know, I do have TK Maxx and the range. I'm so excited to show you them. I do actually have the... Um, home bargains. I do have a home bargains um, Halloween thing as well to show you and then it's it's down to spooky boxes and kill star and stuff like that guys so won't be long i shall be back very very soon and we will do we'll probably do the whole bargains next guys we're just going to save the best to last all right guys don't forget to ring the bell if you haven't already pop your comments on below tell me what you think of the Poundland um haul that i've got i think these are absolutely amazing <clears throat> let me know if you found any of these finds in your pound shop if not go ahead and check them out all right, guys, take care of yourself, and I'll see you very, very soon. Bye for now, spooky people. Bye. And how rude of me. I forgot to show you this. Guys, I did buy an item of clothing. Nearly forgot to show you. I picked up this because it's black, and I like to wear black. And it says, you need cuddle. So as you know, I am going in hospital, and you all know, because I keep telling you, but I've got another mighty because I might be there longer than I thought now. So um, I grabbed this and it was £5. And I think for £5 it was worth it. When you think of what I paid for the other two. Um, and that is that. So that is it guys. Take care and I'll see you very soon. Bye for now.